Hi, this is Vivek Ramurthy from Infimetka Global Customer Support. In this video, we will see how to change the host name of Infimetka node. Let's move to the agenda of this video. Steps to change the host name of Infimetka node and we will see a quick demo. Steps to change the host name of Infimetka node. First of all, we will have to shut down the Infimetka services. Take a backup of nodemeter.xml file from infra home isp config directory. Run the below command from infra home isp bin directory on the node infra setup.sh or .bat update gateway node hyphen na new hostname colon port number hyphen rst true. Start the services on the node. Login to admin console using new hostname in the URL to confirm if the URL has the new host name. Let's move to the demo. Uh, let me log into the server. Uh, you can see I have logged into the server and current host name is vento.informatica.com. Right now I am in Tomcat bin directory. Uh, let me shut down the services. Let me go to ISP config directory. Let me confirm the entries in nodemeter.xml for the host name. You can see the current host name is Vento. Let me take a backup of nodemeter.xml as nodemeter.xml underscore backup. Let's go back to ISP bin directory and uh, right now I am in infra home ISP bin directory. Uh, let me run the command to change the host name dot slash infra setup dot sh update gateway node iPhone NA as the new host name. I will be changing the host name from Vento to inglx72.informatica.com colon port number iPhone IRST true. Let me confirm if the changes got affected cat on node meta.xml file let's verify the host name you can see the host name got changed to inglx72 informatica.com let me log into the uh, new host name we moved to Let's verify the hostname by running hostname command. You can see right now we are on inglx72.informatica.com. I am in infra home directory. Let's go to ISP config and confirm the entries in nodemeter.xml file. So we can see that the hostname is pointing to nglx72.informatica.com. Uh, let's start the services. services. Uh, let's confirm if the services came up from the entries in the node.log. Uh, we can see that the last entry as request to start process for service admin console was successful. Mm, this means the services came up. Let me log into the admin console URL 
to confirm if the hostname got changed so i will be using the new hostname into the url you can see http colon slash slash nglx72 colon port number slash administrator i am using uh, let me log in i will to log in and uh, let me click on services and nodes uh, you can see let me click on the node properties this is node properties and you can see the host name as inglx72.informatica.com this confirms that the host name got changed successfully uh, let's move back to the presentation We would love to hear from you at our email address supportvideos at informatica.com. You can also tweet your feedback on our Twitter handle InfoSupport. Thank you for watching this video.